Seems to me, General, Dr. Stone put one over on you. In fact, he made us all think his wildfire lab could handle any contamination from outer space. I disagree with the senator from Vermont. Dr. Stone, a Nobel Prize winner, twice president of the National Academy of Sciences, is well known here in Washington. Is the implication that Dr. Stone deliberately misled us? Perhaps not deliberately, Senator. I'm reasonably certain that before the night the wildfire team was mobilized, Dr. Stone didn't know Scoop existed. I'm astounded. Reasons of national security. Very smart. We've had experiences with scientists before. Now, let's talk about this famous letter Dr. Stone sent to the President some two years ago. From what you're saying, General, it was just a shot in the dark. Perhaps that's a little unfair, Senator. Dr. Stone and I were consultants with NASA on the Lunar Receiving Lab. He wasn't completely satisfied with that. He felt a more advanced lab was required. You mean more expensive, don't you? I call that Dr. Stone's $90 million mash note to Uncle Sam. In a true biological crisis which our exploration of space could bring about, the present lunar receiving laboratory might prove inadequate. I therefore urge the establishment of a facility to deal specifically with an extraterrestrial form of life. The purpose of this facility would be to limit the dissemination of such an unknown organism from outer space and to provide laboratories for its analysis. I recommend that this facility be located in an uninhabited region of the United States, that it utilize all known isolation techniques that it be equipped with a nuclear device for self-destruction in the event of an emergency. It was very truly Jeremy Stone. Uh, we're about to enter the town of Piedmont and recover the satellite. Very good, Caper One. Leave your radio open. Roger. We're now inside the town. This is kind of spooky. I see a church steeple ahead on the left. I mean, it's quiet here. It's the damnedest thing. There's no sign of life. The signals from the satellite are getting very strong. Sir! You see that, Lieutenant? See what, Green? Over there by the fence. Look, it looks like a body. Easy, Green. You're imagining things. Oh, Sir, it's another one. You're right. Looks dead. Yes, sir. Shall I go? Uh... No, sir. Stay in the van. Wow, they don't already look dead, Lieutenant. They're all over the place. Must be dozens of them. Damn it, get this call through. It's sort of like they just dropped in their tracks, sir. Sir! Good crap. You, you see that thing in white? Yeah, it's coming toward us. Hello, Major. This may sound crazy, but there's something strange going on with Caper 1. Lieutenant, sir, I think we should get out of here. General was a side for wildfire chosen. Largely Dr. Stone's. It seemed ideal to him because of his remoteness. There's no inhabited area near wildfire for a radius of 112 miles. Until I saw those photos from Vandenberg, I... They brought it on themselves. Who? The people in Piedmont? Las Vegas is to the north, Phoenix to the south, Los Angeles west. Weren't you worried the infection might spread to them? Yes, sir, I was. But Dr. Stone and Dr. Robertson assured the president wildfire was foolproof because of its device for atomic self-destruct. The military had to take a back seat. It's against the Moscow Treaty of 1963 to fire thermal nuclear weapons above ground. The Russians will have to be privately informed we're going to colorize the area. Then they'll ask a flock of questions. Some we don't want answered. That'll take hours. God knows how far the infection can spread in that time. Wildfire is equipped with a nuclear device for self-destruct. In an emergency, it's activated automatically. I've just inserted the key in the main station that arms the mechanism. The device is ready for detonation. When? Never, we hope. It only goes off if there's danger of infection breaking out from here. We're on level one of a five-story cylindrical underground structure surrounded by solid rock. Each level has three substations, indicated by the yellow lights. 
In the event the nuclear device is triggered, you can still cancel self-destruct by inserting your red key in a substation. Thank you.